Okay. Yes. So it was just like taking out the Flint Company mercenary groups. It was nothing exciting, but now we can tell Sebastian that his family's because they um they killed his family. So yeah. I'm just reminding myself because I did take a break, so I'm it's hard to remember which mission was for what thing, you know. Now there's one more thing we're supposed to find out from the Dalish about some herbalist um ingredient that he wants. Shemlin. Wonderful. Oh. Mara. So you've returned. How has your time been among the Shemlin? It's been nothing but roses and rainbows, Master Island. The alienage is hmm. lovely in the spring. The collapsing shacks and drunken brutes are nicely offset by the knee-deep mud. This path has been of your own choosing, Meryl. A path that has saddened the clan greatly. Perhaps if the clan was more accepting of the ancient ways and not so mired in fear. Enough. We will not bicker like children in front of strangers. We cannot undo what is done. My apologies for that display. Interesting. I didn't even think about the fact that I was bringing her. A crafter for this clan. For okay. to stay so close to this Shemlin city, I've seen my share of outsiders pass through our camp. Is there something you needed? Yes. Do you have any pure iron bark in stock? What use is iron bark to you? I've never met a Shem. None of your concern. Either way, I'm out of stock. I do know where it can be found, but it is impossible to retrieve. Why? We were forbidden from venturing to the area after we lost two of our best hunters there. What's the problem? Maybe I can give you a hand dealing with it. I find it insulting that you think you would succeed where we could not. I don't care. Overrun by Darkspawn. If we tried to eradicate them, we would risk the precious few hunters we have left. I'll show you where the area is. What you do with the information is up to you. Don't hold Jeez. Like that. You'll cut off your Okay. Okay, leave area. I just want to know if it's here or not. It's not. Oh, it's a special area. Oh, look. Oh, dear. Okay. Don't look at him. Just kill him. Mabari Collar. Can I give that to him? No, I don't think so. Oh. It was right there. Cool. All right, that was not so bad. Okay. But I didn't think we had everything he asked for. It said like a dragon tooth and spider thing, I think. But let's see what it says. Things about you, Anders, not what I expected. From a mage, you mean? I didn't say that. How else would you judge me? Whatever. Everyone's always like thinking Aveline's trying to insult them. Other Ferelden's lurking in Darktown, mage or not. You have a fair point. She never seems like she's like sneakily trying to be rude to people. I don't know why they always think she's mad at them. It's perfect. Okay, quest updated. Shepherding wolves, Varric's contact said a Chantry sister has been flashing coin around a low town, fishing for help with some unmanned problem. Details are light, but it may have something to do with the Cunari. He recommends checking for her in low town. Sure, let's do it. Sister Petrus. Here, miss. I didn't hear what she was going to say. For help and pay well. I need someone native to the dark places beneath low town. If you claim as much, Yes, I will pay. I am, I am. Let's just step into this alley. Me and my fellows can have a look at the money on offer. Can she expect step into the alley? Inviting that kind of attention. It does appear she could use some help, especially now. Okay. Oh. <laughs> Dude, look how casual she is. Well, thank you for your timely intervention. I am out of my element. A 
foolish risk in Lotan. I had to come here to get the type of person I need. Someone of bloody skill, but also integrity. Perhaps the kind who might leap to someone's defense. I have a charge who needs passage from the city. If you are willing and capable, meet me at my safe house nearby. I just saved you in an alley, and <laughs> suddenly we're in business? Did you give me a business card? What grand scheme could I be interrupting? Varnell! Not so a Templar. Close, I see. I hope you will come. This matter only grows more urgent with time. Alright. I'll do it because it's in my quest list. Petrus's safe house. Somehow I think this won't go well. <laughs> I am expected. You just saw me. I thank you for coming. This matter is delicate, and I need someone of limited notoriety who will not link this to me. It is an escort, but I think you will agree the nature of the party makes this unique. Uh -huh. If this is criminal, I already have enough trouble. I should think you're about to have more. I am Sister Patrice. This is my burden of charity. Oh, Shit. Lord. Would even a Templar bind a mage like this? A survivor of infighting with their Talbashoth outcasts. I call him Katojin, a bridge between worlds. The Viscount and others feel that peace begins with appeasement. This mage would likely be returned to his brutal kin. He can serve a better purpose. I want him free. He must be guided from the city without alerting his people, or being seen in my care. I've had dealings with the Kunari leader. He'd want to know of this. You have dealt with their leader. If you have interacted with Kunari, you know how they treat those who leave their heathen order. The Arashok would doom this yeah. creature. But knowing them is useful. If they challenged you, attacking an ally would only confirm their barbarism. You are still right for the task. I can get him out. All right. He's a bit conspicuous for the streets, though. I had never thought about the plight of mages among the Canari. But it seems they are even more oppressed than we are. This mage will be a fine example of how cruel Kunari are, even to their own. But only if this plays out just so. Right, so he's a mage. To the warrens of the Undercity. Weird. It is dangerous, but that is why you were hired. Good luck. The warrens of the Undercity. Huh. Okay. There goes nothing. Oh, hmm. Look at this. Undercity is feared by all. But there's no shortage of fools with coin who want to test it. What is this thing? Call it like a dumb lord's bitch. <laughs> Some sort of canary that Wow. Well. Maybe I should get rid of you and see who will pay the most for your pet. You tell him. I don't think he likes you threatening his master. Maybe we let this one pass. A voice of reason. What's he doing with you? You lot think you're so damn right. Buying everything, running free marches like me into our own sewers. You want us bound. Like this thing. I see No. First. Okay. Oh. By the void. Kill it. Kill them all. What the heck? He tried to attack first. Oh well, it's fine. We won. The danger has passed, Katojin. Calm yourself. I'm getting you out of here before you help again. <laughs> Still clear as a bell. Great. <laughs> um... 
now we have more Talvashoth waiting for us. You will hold Basra Bashidan. I am Arvarad, and I claim possession of Sarabas at your heel. The members of this Karatom were killed by Talvashoth, but their disposal leads only here to Sarabas and you. Um. How did I know this job would end in more, Kunari? You speak as if ignorance is your natural condition. The bodies of his slain Karatom could lead only here. I do not know how you come to hold his leash, but you have no claim in the cube. He will be returned and this crime cleansed. And if he doesn't want to go back, Sarabas, show that your will remains bound to the Kune. <laughs> he has only followed you because he wants to be led. He has allowed no other purpose. So, God, what do I do? I'm not giving him to you. He'll choose his own path. He wants what the Kune demands. He is nothing else. Well, I don't know you that yet, so... Your kind have no sense. The opportunity for reason will be forced upon you. Uh-oh. You will all be brought to the Kuhn. Um... Good. <laughs> this is a good choice, I think. Can you stand? It's a control rod. I am unbound. Odd. Wrong. But you deserve honor. Oh, his lips. E. As Varad, worthy of following. I thank your intent, even if it was wrong. I know the will of our Varad. I must return as it demanded. It is the wisdom of the Kuhn. He's still going back? So after all this, now you want to die? I do not want to die. I want to live by the cube. Which means dying. Yes. Is that hard to grasp? But it's his choice. What can I do? Ended when we exited the city. The rest is up to you. You know of certainty and borders. You are closer to the Canari than you admit. Your rules okay. change little if you accepted the Kune. Take this secret thing, Basvarad. Remember this day. Wow. How pointless. Quests with these guys are always pointless. But the creature was free. She may not have known about this, but clearly Patrice set a trail right to us. Mm. I have a few questions for her. Leave nothing. It must be clean with no ties. It... Well, my helpful associate from the streets. You... Took the Kunari from the city? Without incident? You know what we faced. Mind your tongue, Ferelden. Who oh, the What? Do speak your mind. Don't string me along. You know that I know. Whether you believe it or not, I wished you no harm. That might have been useful for someone, but still regrettable. A massacre of citizens protecting a slave might have forced the Chantry to doubt appeasement, to see the Kunari for the monsters they are. Perhaps 
finding the mage was a rushed opportunity. If such a plot existed, I see how it might be disagreeable to you. Your Katojan killed himself rather than be free. I assumed he wanted to escape, just as I would. My pity is genuine, but they are not like us. If, perhaps, why dance around this lie? I'm standing right here. If a member of the Chantry admitted instigation, I have no doubt it would result in more appeasement. But an accusation from a low town thug, you are not that important. Okay, trying to keep up. It's not an insult. It's why I chose you. Rest assured, excuses, real or imagined, are not for your benefit. I won't forget this, sister. Take your coin. Disappear back into Lowtown. Rest assured, I will not make the mistake of looking for help outside the faithful again. This is your fault. Eternity are just too high. You're taking a risk. Wow, okay, seven coins. I'll take that. Okay, now that that's done. Reward offered. My dear wife Nina has gone missing. I'll reward the person who returns your safety. Okay, speak to me in the high town market. Sure. His wife got uh, taken? This is a domestic matter, Sirat. If your wife has chosen to leave you, there's nothing we can do. Ninat is my wife. She's legally bound to me. Bring her back. We're done. Mm. <laughs> he already sounds like... Why are we still paying those sluggards? Your wife is missing. I can try to find her if you like. Yes. Oh, I have been waiting for someone to say that. That foolish woman has caused me nothing but embarrassment. She's to be dragged home. The guards disagree. They are more disagreeable than my wife. Maybe your friend is more sensible. Her family <laughs> is getting suspicious. They think I might have done something to her. Even if... Well, I just want to make sure they know I didn't do it. I'll help you, but... If she doesn't want to come back, I'm not forcing her. The blooming rose. I didn't know she visited halls until Jethan sent a letter to our house. He even sent her flowers, rose. lilies. Mm. Oh no! <laughs> no! Talking about it makes my head hurt. Good luck to you, sir. Okay. Okay. We're gonna talk to him about mm, the Viscount's son. I wish to. <clears throat> I've heard you have dealings with certain elements in the city. You can get things done on the sly, as they say. Is there something I can help with? I am a magistrate in this city, and as such, I wish to hire you for a small, albeit important job. A man I think okay. to a life in prison has escaped custody. He's been tracked to an abandoned ruin outside the city. A request that should have been made of the guard. We're both intelligent people. There's something in the ruins, isn't there? There is something, yes. There are creatures in the ruins. The creatures. The sent are ill-equipped to deal with such beasts. I'll take it. Sure. You. We need money. Live in alive, quickly and quietly. Not only will you be well paid, you'll have the gratitude of a city magistrate. Useful for a refugee, wouldn't you agree? When he says it like that, it makes me think he will <laughs> never help me. Now, Matcha. Uh, Varric said there is a lady Can you help looking me? for her brother. My brother. What happened to your brother? Karen was always so devout. So idealistic. He was so proud when the Templars accepted him. I pleaded with him not to join the Order, but he wouldn't listen. You hear dark rumors about the Templars and Knight Commander Meredith. You do? And now my brother is gone. 
I'm here to help you. Just tell me what you know. Karen would write me every day. Then suddenly, no more letters. I wrote him many times with no response. I tried to see him, but Knight Commander Meredith threw me out. They won't tell me anything. Your brother may indeed be in trouble. What can I do for you? Perchance, in your journeys, if you find yourself in the gallows, ask the other recruits, Wilmot and Hugh, about my brother. Okay. Karen's closest friends in the order. So he's just gone? He is. It's them. May God bless you and watch after you in this endeavor. Okay. I'm definitely going to take care of that. Kirkwall deserves better. The Grand Cleric's a doddering fool. Huh. Okay. We avenged your family, sir. Their killers are gone. Excuse me, who are... My post to the Chancellor's board? Did Her Grace let that stay? I thought for sure no one even read. But you say you've killed them. You have my eternal gratitude, Sirrah. It is comforting to think my parents might now rest easily in their graves. I hope their deaths bring you peace. Thank you. More than I can say. I truly did not expect anyone but me to take up this cause. Consider this in advance. Mm. When I have secured my lands again, you will be paid royally. Now, if you'll excuse me, I must meet with the Viscount and petition him for aid to a fellow city. So, you married a Templar, huh? What of it? Are they all as dirty as they seem? What? Anders. Did he ever ask you to play the naughty mage and the hapless recruit? Maybe the secret designer Anders. Of the upstanding knight. That's disgusting. I hear it's quite popular. Anders, what do you mean you hear? Weirdo. Okay, first we're going to the blooming rose. Um I know I'm not doing well at keeping these uh, missions organized, but I can't help it. It's hard. Yeah, we're going to go talk to... I just said we we're going to that brothel thing, but now... Sorry. We're going to find out about this lady's brother. Have an alien itch. Do you know a recruit named Karen? His sister is looking for him. We cannot speak to you, Miss Sarah. To the void with that. Karen and the others are missing. But our orders... The knights aren't doing anything to find them. Maybe it's time to ask for outside help. What is happening? You can trust me. I'm only trying to keep Karen safe. I hear that Knight Commander Meredith has some new initiation you have to go through. If you're not strong enough or fervent enough in belief, you don't make it out alive. Figures. And you honestly believe that? Recruits keep going missing. Wilmot came back. What? He did. I saw him this morning. Where is he? If Wilmot came back, he might know more about the other missing recruits. I bet he would. Wilmot told me he was going outside Kirkwall. Clear his head, he said. Why didn't you tell us this? Night Captain Cullen ordered it. Right before he chased after Wilmot. That was Cullen. If you hurry, you may catch them on the road. Okay. All these people are hateful. And trust they be my witness, Wilmot. I will have the truth from you now. Mercy, sir. Mercy. Were it that easy? Don't hit me. Cullen. I will know where you're going, and I will know now. Why are you doing this to Wilmot? Answer me. This is Templar business, stranger. <laughs> you have struck me the last time, you pathetic human. To me! I was not expecting that. Wow. Make her preserve us. And you'll be fine. Dude, I knew, I 
Okay, I apologize. You were right. But this... Is it even possible? Do you think he was possessed? Normally, we only worry that mages will fall victim to possession. I have heard of blood mages or demons in solid form who could send others into unwilling hosts. Hmm. I had not thought one of our own would be susceptible. You shouldn't have been out here alone with him. I am Knight Captain Cullen. I thank your assistance. I have been conducting an investigation of some of our recruits who have gone missing. Wilmot was the first to return. I had hoped to confront him quietly, out of sight. I was trying to find another recruit, a friend of Wilmot's. Do you know where Karen is? He also disappeared. They were last seen together at the Blooming Rose. Ah. I had no luck interrogating the uh, young ladies there. I doubt they know anything of magic or demons. He's nice. Um, I'm going to tease him. Are you willing to search there? Oh, that's not what I meant. I'll truly be in your debt if you help us with this. No one at the brothel will speak with me for fear I would shut them down for serving our recruits. If you learn what manner of creature did this to Wilmot, please come tell me in the gallows. I will ensure you are rewarded. Okay. Glad I did this one first because it's still leading us to the same place we're supposed to go. Do you ever miss Ferelden? Of course. It was home. I would never have left willingly. But I'm not going to be my father and spend my life trying to live a memory. I didn't think I'd give it a second thought once I was gone. I mean, what did Ferelden ever do for me? But I do. I think about it. There's something here that just doesn't feel right. You mean how mages are treated? No. I think there's not enough dog shit. He is weird. I'm officially saying he's a little weird. Interesting place. Oh, it's so lovely. Let's <laughs> not stay here for long. Meryl. If someone here tries to hire me again, I'm leaving. <laughs> Okay. No, but it might help me not get caught. You probably shouldn't have said that part. You get caught what? Never mind. Meryl, be quiet. Everyone be quiet. Today is my rest day, but I'll make an exception for you. What yeah, okay. Why work if you're not working hard? Jathan, have you seen <laughs> Nanette lately? Nanette? Not for several weeks, which is a shame. I enjoy her company. I hear she finally left her worthless husband. Good for her. I just wish she'd said goodbye. Hmm. Were you hoping Nanette would leave Ghislaine for you? Of that's course. not what I meant. I know my place. I offer a service, that's all. Anyway, there was someone else looking for Nanette. A Templar. I believe his name was Emmerich. He wouldn't sleep with me either. I can't see why a Templar would be interested in anyone who isn't a mage. Someone else Nanette spent special alone time with, perhaps? She always liked men in uniform. You could ask him yourself. Emmerich said he'd continue his investigation in Darktown. You could see if he's still there. And if you find Nanette, tell her to drop by and see me sometime. Um, why does it have a... Um... Am I supposed to speak to him or what? Sure you're not interested in my many, many services? I was just passing through. Have it your way. Hmm. I don't know. Do you need something, honey? A couple of Templar recruits went missing. They were last seen here. You'll have to be more specific. We do a lot of business with the Templars. Perhaps if you could. I feel like that's probably the only way. Are you trying to bribe me? You know, not all the girls here are for sale. That's I not. Pretend that didn't happen. Okay. We have a lot of missing templars. If we don't act quickly, we may only find corpses. Now, now, no need to get all dramatic on me. Let me look through the books. 
Wilma, Karen. Here we go. Wilmud came in here a lot. You sure he had time to be a Templar? <laughs> the both of them last saw Iduna, the exotic wonder from the east. Is there anything else you can tell me? Honey, I could write volumes on the things I know. Unless you want Wilmud's favorite position. Um, you have what no, you I'm good. You did okay, okay. From me. We clear? Iduna, right? Do you remember entertaining a Templar named Wilmud a few weeks ago? Or Karen? Wilmud. Wilmot. That doesn't sound familiar. I know he saw you frequently. With a body like mine, men rarely have time to give me their names. They're too busy to like... other things. Okay, cool. Can you tell me about... Wilmot? Questions are boring. Why don't we have some real... It can't be easy for a girl in her position. You should listen to your friend. She doesn't sound like she's uh, feeling bad for herself. <sighs> What's wrong with you? We have to ask her about Karen. What's your problem? No, I wasn't speaking to Aveline. Be gentle if you can. I'm here on business. Karen. Wilmot. Answer one of my questions first. Who told you about little old me? What is that? It was Vivica. She showed me her book. She is not good. So hard, was it? So no, you're done. Me out, did she? That drab, pathetic little sewer rat. She will be dealt with. Oh, okay. What about now? <laughs> thing for me. Draw your blade and bring it gently across your throat. What? I will not obey you. What are you doing? Oh, now you're scared. Mm hmm. Freaking tried to get me to tell myself what's wrong with you. That was unpleasant. How? Blood magic. It must be. Search her room. We need to know what's going on. Freaking. It seems these mages hide in the Undercity. In the Undercity? Hmm. Okay, so we're headed to the Undercity. Okay, this is where we can confront those blood mages. So, what do we got here? What is that? How wonderful. More vessels for our experiments. Where is Karen? Perhaps the demons will find one of you suitable. Always the demon thing. Can't you people say no? I am not some hopeless waif that ran crying to a demon. I sought them out and embraced them. Why have you taken the recruits? Demons can inhabit much more than mages and corpses. With assistance, they can control anyone I ask. Any oh, great. Any noble. No, nope, you're done. Meaning meddler. You do know I cut a path through your abominations, right? Good, good. The demons like spirit. If a few more Templars fall to the demons, we can seed chaos in their ranks. How many abominations can they discover amongst their own before it drives the Knight Commander crazy? Tell me where Karen is. The experiments need so much fuel, you see. So many living vessels are found wanting. Useless vessels can still feed the compost heap. 
So it's not a complete waste. Oh my gosh. You're barking mad. That makes things easier. Honestly? Old, the De Winter Imperium spanned the known world. Demons were their allies, held in check by power and knowledge. With a wave of a hand, I could do more than a Templar can achieve in a lifetime. Yet they command us. Absurd. We because you have a lot of power. You all. Kill the vessels only if you must. Okay. Is he free? Get him out, get him out. Poor guy, dang. Is it is it over? Yes. Yes. That's my name. Oh, thank the maker. I thought he had abandoned me. Be careful, Hawk. He was influenced. The cage has opened. Thank Andraste. Meryl? You know something about this. Is he possessed? I don't know. It's... It's clean. There's no scent of demons in his blood. Gosh, it's so useful to have the right people with me. Just... Go ahead and leave, Karen. You've been through enough. Don't tell the Templars. I, I don't know what they do to me. I trust Meryl. I need to go back. Tell them I'm all right. Tell my sister. I... I must go. When you talk to Sir Cullen, maybe downplay the blood magic angle. Yeah. I need the Templars cracking down even harder. Okay. We saved him. That's really good. This is where that husband's... The husband's wife went missing now we're gonna speak to oh well i don't know i guess we're gonna speak to a um a templar that she was meeting with what is that i thank you sirrah for coming along when you did okay it's you emmerich what are you doing here I need to speak with you about Nanette. Ah, Ghislaine de Carac's wife. Her disappearance interested me. I tried looking into it. However, hmm. the investigation has been a waste of time. Did you learn nothing? Most people just say she left her husband. This all started when Meren, one of our circle mages, disappeared. I found it odd. She was a bit older and hardly adventurous. Then I heard about Ninette and two other missing women. Uh oh. And doubts that they merely fled. I think the disappearances are connected, and I suspect foul play is involved. I don't like the sound of this. For real. Neither do Sounds kind of. But I cannot carry on. This battle showed that I'm no longer the warrior I used to be. I know when to walk away. Here, take my findings. Perhaps you can make more use of them. I'm going back to the gallows. I'm too old for this. Okay, that's all right. What is a foundry? I don't know what that means so oh good they're back together infiltrated legs they've been implanting your recruits with demons sweet blood of andraste demons did you say something about the recruits and demons i didn't want to tell you masha they they were horrible those mages see the rest of us as ants to be crushed they won't stop until they've destroyed the Chantry and the Templars forever. I don't know. Just whatever. For now, I'm not. Who is right and wrong is academic. Wrong. 
This is no stuffy scholars' debate. This is the central fact of the world that Andres Day recognized. <sighs> but I will not preach. Thank you for your service. For real, you couldn't get it done. Mission now, pending investigation. If there is any chance, he still harbors a No. No, you can't really think that. Karen's fine. He's safe. Please, he is safe. I tried to resist. I never took anything they offered. I, I need this position, or my sister can't eat. I've been training for five years. He's looking at me. We conducted tests on Karen. He's not possessed. He can stay in the order. I hesitate to ask what methods you used that you are so certain. Still, you have done much for us by stopping these blood mages. I will heed your request. If he has shown no sign of demonic possession in ten years' time, Karen will become eligible for full knighthood. Thank you, Sarah. Again. But without a full knighthood, Karen's pay is so small. I do not know if I can reward you as you deserve. I will handle that, miss. You have done the order a great Perfect. Sir. We'll not forget it. <sighs> How much money do I have? Okay, I have enough to go on the expedition. I needed 50. So, the rest of this is just extra. Let me see. Cannot be followed up at this time. These are what I need to do. Yep, just these four. Okay. We'll get them done.